hello everyone in this video i'm going to show about pen or ink illustrations i'm going to use a marker but you can use whatever is available with you right now like pen or pencil in this technique whole drawing is done with just one color first let us look at the four basic techniques used in pen or ink drawings for each one of these techniques we are going to draw a sphere because sphere is a rounded 3d form it will allow you to create gradations or slow changes in value from dark to light so let's start first one is hatching with hatching we are going to create uniform lines first draw a sphere For any subject that you draw, you should always consider the light source. In this case, the light source is originating from the upper left hand side. This means the value will be darker on the lower right hand portion of the sphere. To make value darker, we will add more horizontal lines. By placing the lines between the original lines that we draw, the value is perceived as being darker. Here I use the horizontal direction but you can use any direction but uh, all the lines should be in the same direction. Let us draw a shadow. Shadow will be more darker right so we are using more, more lines parallel to each other ok the next one is cross hatching technique it will begin just as hatching did by creating some horizontal lines again here also the same we need not do it in just horizontal direction you can choose whichever direction you want next uh, they need to be the the direction we create additional lines over the top of these horizontal lines the darker the freq the greater the frequency of the lines that are added the darker the value becomes with each layer of lines that are added to the drawing the direction changes we will draw the shadow in the same way it's I think it's done the third technique we'll talk about is using random lines or swiggly lines with these random lines will be very loose without marks we can create lines that go in various random directions the greater the frequency these lines cross over each other the darker will be the perceived value this is a great technique to create the illusion of a texture out of the four techniques using random lines is definitely the quickest way to build value in drawing yeah it's done very fast the fourth technique we discuss is called stippling or dot technique stippling occurs when small countless dots are added to a drawing in order to create the value range the closer the dots are made to each other the darker the perceived value will be just like the other three examples we consider the light source is originating from upper left hand side this means the value will be the darker in the lower right portion of the sphere to create this illusion we add more dots with greater frequency 
in the right hand portion of the spear out of the four techniques tipping definitely takes the longest amount of time however it gives the artist the greatest control over the range of value slow gradations or changes in value are easily accomplished using this technique for drawing uh, you can use any one of these techniques whole drawing will be uniform if you use only one technique but you can also experiment uh, by mixing these techniques each object each technique you can do whatever you like